you know, I, I started playing saxophone. That was the first instrument I played. I originally started in fifth grade. I've been playing since then. Saxophone was developed for classical music first. It came before, well before jazz was even a thing. The way a classical player sounds versus a jazz player sound very different. And I think saxophone fits that a lot better than other instruments because of the versatility. We were just playing the first movement of the American Quartet by Dvorak. This is interesting because this is how the saxophone quartet began. Um, playing string quartets because the, the piece was originally a string quartet. A lot of our music stems from composers from the 20th century and 21st. Even now, there's not really a place for saxophone and orchestra, but what we do have a uh, kind of like a really big involvement in it is contemporary music, which is why the new music conference is a really big deal for us because new composers like to write for saxophone because it's a very versatile instrument. Both the pieces really kind of stretch what you would consider normal technique on an instrument because we're doing a lot of things you have to actually like look up how to do before I actually play it. There are really interesting moments in it where a lot of things are clashing. It's very noisy and unsettling, um, but then it's combated with a section that's very calm and serene and very like glass-like. It's hard to describe the feeling after you perform and you know people get up and clap for you. Like it's just, it, you really don't get that in a lot of other fields. This has been Olivia Ekstrom for the Medill School of Journalism.